Alright, what's good? I'm back here again with another preset video. In this video, I'm going to be showing y'all how to set up my presets and how to record on FL, etc. How to install everything. So, I'm going to make this video quick because this is the third time I'm recording this. I have more mic problems. So, first one I'm going to show y'all is this preset for FL I made. And I guess you call it a preset, but it's, I call it a song template. And y'all need to have like the full version of FL for this to use for to use this. So I'ma just DM me on IG if y'all need the crack version of FL because I know none of y'all are trying to pay $300, $400 for full FL. So all you gotta do when you download this from the link in the description, you wanna double click it and it should load it up into FL. So what you wanna do is you wanna go to raw, which is where you're gonna be recording. You wanna click N1 and then your recording should it should be yellow right here so now you want to get your beat and let's say this is my beat right here and your beat will automatically be on this slide since it says beat up here it'll match up with here so let's say i record my vocals right all you gotta do to record is click the little make sure it's on song click record right here and then right when you click play it'll start recording so for example you see this green line and you can see it's recording out here my vocals you can see it's going up on the mixer and then if you want to stop recording you want to click this button the record button again you'll see it stop recording then you want to click the square and you're good so now is where the preset comes into play and you want to drag the preset from file explorer onto the mixer in track one and now you got your preset set up all right so now you got to find the key and the way to find the key is click on the beat if y'all don't got auto key dm me on ig asking for auto key because i got y'all with everything free you already know and what you want to do is you want to go to slot one more plugins auto key click it and click play and let the beat play out because that's the way it finds the key this is more reliable than google anything you use so use this since it's literally from the people who made the auto tune so i would use this so let's say it is c minor you want to make sure it is on the beat slide so what you want to do is you want to click on the preset down here go to auto tune c minor make sure it retune speed all the way up which is how fast the pitches move back and forth humanize i would say if you want that all the way up 100 percent of the time because if you have it low the lower it is the more robotic it's gonna sound and you want to always format format it i think it's format you want to always click this on if not you're gonna sound like even more like a robot i would keep that on even if you're trying to sound like a robot because it sounds way better but yeah that's about it and you don't really want to change nothing else because if you mess with all of these it's gonna mess it up and now i'm gonna show y'all how to put any other auto tune on the preset let's say you don't got auto tune evo and anything like that what you want to do is you want to go down click on number two make sure you're selected on number two it'll say fruity rapper w r a p p e r and what you want to do is click the little down arrow and click delete and then it'll pop up slot one right here but what you want to do is you want to click it go to more plugins and search for the auto tune that you want to put on here let's say it's efx you're gonna double click it and now it'll pop up the efx same thing let's say i want it to be c minor retune speed all the way up humanize all the way up format on soprano on now i'm gonna show y'all how to put the vocals that you recorded onto the preset so all you gotta do now that you recorded it down here all you gotta do it's as simple as this drag it up to the number one spot that's all you gotta do and just to make sure it's on you want to double click it right here in the playlist you want to turn it to two track two if it's not on track two this is just to prove that the preset is on i'm gonna click play so for example you see there you go that's how you get the preset to work you never want to record on the preset so this has to say none you always want to record on raw because if you don't record on raw then it's gonna mess up your vocals and you're if you're trying to take plug in off of your vocals it's not gonna work so you want to record on raw so let's say if i wanted to take off everything then i could just click the plugin or i could just click the preset and so for example everything will be off again 
so yeah that's it for that part and now i'm gonna show y'all how to install autotune and fresh air so first i'm gonna start out with the autotune bundle once you click it in the email it'll pop up this i'm gonna click download and then download anyway basically what this is saying is that it can't scan it for viruses because it's too big of a file but that's okay because i'll be showing y'all how to virus scan it if y'all don't trust me i'll even virus scan it myself in fresh air same thing download and then same thing for autotune evo download give it a second and then it'll download do you want to click down here you want to click keep because it's trusted i trust me on everything that is not no virus so as you can see i already tested the autotune bundle drag it on here and now it's searching zero viruses fresh air zero viruses autotune evo zero viruses so the way to install these i'm gonna start out with autotune evo with autotune evo you don't need to do a single thing you don't gotta open it because this is gonna pop up and it's gonna mess your whole thing up maybe and all you gotta do with this is just go on fl and search for plugins which that's what i'm gonna show y'all how to do after i show y'all how to install these so now fresh air open it give it a second you want to click yes for administrator privileges and then next make sure it's on full installation right here and then next leave it as it is if not it's not going to download and you want to click install right here and then wait for it to install and then you're done i'm gonna cancel it because i already got to download it now the autotune bundle should say get into pc.com type 123 123 open it then it'll have two things in a folder a text file and then the autotune exe you want to double click it wait for it to open and now that it's opening just give it a second to open because it's a lot i'm gonna click yes for administrator privileges again then it'll pop up all this rushing but as you can see autotune evo no, i mean autotune key and autotune access autotune artist autotune efx and autotune pro which is the best thing out of this then you will leave it as it is again and then right here leave all this as it is make sure they're all checked this won't pop up for you unless you got fl open you want to make sure you don't got fl open when you're doing all this and if you do just click next and install it and you're good i'm gonna cancel out once again because i have it already and then you want to open back fl you want to go to options manage plugins and then it'll pop up this right here and you want to click find plugins and it'll start searching i'm gonna cancel it because i already did it but what that does is it searches your pc through all the files and it downloads the auto tune onto here and the way to make sure that you downloaded it once the thing is done i'm gonna type auto tune and it'll have all these auto tunes on here and then fresh air same thing fresh air and yeah that's it then just restart your fl if the preset says it's that it can't find it to restart your fl you should be good but yeah that's it for this video if y'all need any more help with the getting the stuff getting the auto tune getting the fresh air dm me on instagram if y'all need cracked fl dm me on instagram hope this video helped y'all because i had a bunch of people testing me while i was at school and everything on how to fix it how to get it to work and everything so i hope this video helped y'all that was having those problems but yeah that's it for this video Peace.